Hello and welcome to Sigma Excel Video Tutorials. In this video, I cover the two sample comparison test, which is a powerful tool unique to Sigma Excel. The two sample comparison test checks each sample for normality, equal variance, F test and Levine's, two sample T test, assuming equal and unequal variance, and Mann Whitney test for equal medians. Depending on the normality, variance, and sample size results, the appropriate p-values will be highlighted in yellow. To demonstrate, I'll be using a sample data set called Customer Data. Click Sigma Excel, Statistical Tools, Two Sample Comparison Test. Ensure that the entire data table is selected. If not, check Use Entire Data Table. Click Next. Ensure stack column format is selected. Select Overall Satisfaction and click Numeric Data Variable Y. Select Customer Type and click Group Category X. Click OK. We'll be looking at the comparison between customer types 1 and 2. Select 1 and 2 by clicking the selection arrow. Click OK. The low p-value given for customer type 2 indicates non-normal data. This makes Levine's test the appropriate test for unequal variance. The low p-value in Levine's test indicates that customer type 2 has a significantly lower variance or standard deviation. The lower standard deviation translates to a consistent level of satisfaction. Since Levine's test indicates unequal variance, the appropriate t-test assumes unequal variance. The low p-value in the t-test indicates that customer type 2 has a significantly higher mean satisfaction. The two-sample Mann-Whitney test also shows a significant difference in medians. This test is highlighted when the data are not normal and the sample size is small. Clearly, the next step would be to determine a root cause or best practices to reduce the variability in overall satisfaction and increase the mean for all customer types. This concludes the two sample comparison test tutorial video. For more videos, visit www.sigmaxl.com or join us on YouTube. Thank you for watching.